In this video, I will show you how you can pair and start the Shizuku service. Let's open Shizuku. First step is tap on pairing and tap on developer options. You're gonna make sure that the developer options are enabled on your Android phone. I have already enabled it. Please scroll down on the developer options and we're gonna find the wireless debugging option and turn this on. Now tap on allow. Now tap on pair device with pairing code and we're gonna need this code here 236822. Swipe down from the status bar, tap on Shizuku drop down and tap on enter pairing code. Tap on send. Now the pairing has been successful. Now if you go to Shizuku, go back to Shizuku, go back once again and tap on start here. Now it will start the Shizuku service. And you can see Shizuku is successfully running. In some points, pairing might not be successful even after doing all these steps. So what you're gonna do in that case is go back to settings, get inside the developer options and you're gonna have to additionally turn this USB debugging option on. And go to wireless debugging and proceed to pair device with pairing code just like I had shown before. So that's the way how you can pair and start Shizuku on Android. If you like this video then just give a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe my channel. Goodbye. Okay,